What's good, y'all? Let's get into the first film session of the week today. I wanted to talk about pre-snap motion and why we ran the football so much. Um, I said on Twitter earlier today that I will no longer be fussing, fighting, arguing, debating with people online because it seems like no matter what information you bring forward, um, you know, they're still going to, you know, go, you know, they, they're, they're going to argue what they want to argue anyway. The late great black Philip always says, have your opinion. Don't let your opinion have you. And a lot of people, you know, discuss things from a very uninformed standpoint and that's okay. I'll continue to, uh, you know, bring facts and information to the light or whatever, but, uh, and you know answering questions and things like that but uh i'm done fussing so one question that i saw or just one thing that i, that I saw a lot was watch why do we run the ball so much and why was there no pre-snap motion we should fire jason garrett da 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 boom 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 kellen morris trash all that extra little stuff right well i'm of the notion that we just simply didn't execute but you know i ain't in the business for debating that anymore so something i wanted to show you um, and in this video in particular, I, I really wanted to break down uh, just why we were running the ball, some of the looks that we had, offensive philosophy, obligatory plays, if you will. Um, and I also wanted to just every play see if there was pre-snap motion, just if there was or was not pre-snap motion every single play or just any, any kind of movement or just whatever. All right. So, um, obligatory football plays, right? So if you're playing, if you're playing the Saints and Zeke is your best player on your offense, if your offensive line is the best unit, the Saints have given up 400 some odd yards, uh, in the first, the first three games or so, then it'll make sense that you would want to establish the run against them. You know what I mean? That'll, that'll, that'll make sense. And, I said on my post game shows that, you know, you just kind of take what's given to you. If we have the numbers advantage, if we have advantage in terms of like spacing and things like that, then we should run the ball. Cause that's what makes sense. Um, there's motion there. That's just one. Um, and if you take a look at this look, we're supposed to block this look. We have the numbers to be able to 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 block this look. Now, did we execute enough to do it? I mean, that's that's going to change, you know, play to play. Now we got about three or four yards here, in which I consider a um, successful play, but that's just my notion of why we ran it. Now I'm not going to do very much editing here because I don't want y'all to think that I'm involved in some kind of tomfoolery. Um, in my next video, uh, we're, we're uh, talking about Dak plays and drive killers. Okay. So I really want to focus on Zeke right now, why we ran the ball and pre-snap motion. Did we, or did we not do it? Okay. So we got a motion there by Jaden, by, uh, by Jason Witten. Cobb's going to come around on the, uh, on the opposite side there. Why do we run the ball? Well, I think we have favorable numbers here. If we look at blocking scheme, in terms of uh the front six guys the front five guys we don't we don't count all, we don't count um cornerbacks okay if i'm the center if i'm travis frederick and i'm dictating the front then i'm counting one two three four five six guys this guy doesn't exist to us and if this dude does not indeed exist to us this is a favorable front to run into whether we uh whether we uh, you know like trav is not blocking 56 right here right i mean there's two things you got to do to block um to um, run the ball effectively That's uh, deal with a gap you got to block the mic you know this linebacker went went straight down a gap Travis didn't get him, so now we have a botched play. You know what I'm saying? Like, if we execute, this thing looks a lot better. If one, two, three, four, boom. If Travis blocks 56, you know what I mean? Leo's going to come over, take care of 53, and 94 is going to get covered up. If this thing is blocked up front, then from a coaching standpoint, this is a front that we should be able to run into. Now, did it work? Execution. You know what I'm saying? Um, but... Um, um, by the rules in terms of obligatory offensive play calling, that was a front that we can indeed run into. It's a pass play, I believe, but you still get your motion there, uh, from Zeke moving, uh, to the outside. So we haven't had a play without, without pre snap motion just yet. Um, and when I do my, my DAC video, um, next, in which I show you plays that, um, that involve DAC, we're going to talk about pre snap motion in, in, in that video. Um, it's just that, <clears throat> um, I just, I'm here to relatively inform people or whatever. Like, you know, y'all going to have your own opinions, you're going to whatever, whatever. But, you know, a, a lot of people come here for, um, you know, for, for, for just my thoughts on things, for information. So whether you just come to confirm your own opinion or to get mine. <laughs> it's just, it's just how we're going to run it, man. Don't, don't listen to people that only watch the game one time. 
I keep saying that these 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 civilians or these national media people that have probably just skimmed over the game one time or they watched it live one time and they didn't get the full uh, the full you know the the full picture of what of what really happened. Stop listening to them. I, I would rather you do the work on your own um, than to listen to people like them. Um, we got some motion there, and hey, look at this box. This looks like a favorable box to run into. If I'm the center and I'm dictating this front, if I'm the OC, I see this. Hey, let's run into it. Um, did we execute? I don't know. That's going to change play by play you know what i mean it's 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 going to depend on what the execution looks like i sound like a broken like a like a broken record here but i kind of got to be that way i kind of got to repeat myself in order to reiterate my my uh points in here so that there's some some level of understanding uh the first play that we didn't get pre-snap motion is here i'm fine with that um the run hey man it wasn't terrible the YouTube Illuminati is taking money away from your favorite content creators, and people often ask the best way to support the channel directly. I tell them that subscribing to my Patreon. Just $1 a month would increase production and the frequency of uploads. Basically, that means more content for you. For less than a bag of almond M&Ms, you can support the channel, call dibs on requests for future videos, and you can have access to Patreon-exclusive material like my throwback film sessions. That's patreon.com slash Vach Lombardi. I appreciate the support. Doski Woski. Salute. It wasn't terrible. Zeke, Zeke had to do what he had to do. Uh, let's see. Let's go back, go back, go back. Okay, cool. Okay, that's what happened. Uh, yeah, yeah. My my situation loaded funnily, <laughs> and um, I had to reset the the deal or whatever. But let's get back into it. Uh, pre snap movement. You got it, buddy. Um, what the front look like? Let's get into cartel view so we can see the front. That's a favorable front for us to run into. You know what I'm saying? So. Um, it, you know, if 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 you're if you're going against a team and you choose to establish the run, it's not Scott Linehan. Like I, I don't really do the whole thing where we uh, where we associate running the football with Linehan. Every team runs the football. I mean, we're we're Cowboy fans, so we tend to associate it in that way. But um, running the football is a is a valuable strategy, especially if you're going to pay your running back the money that you're that you're paying them. Uh, running the football is is something you, you can win football games with with running the ball. In, in, in case you didn't know, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, didn't execute execution flaws. Execution, execution, and I know a lot of people don't want to talk about execution. They want to point the finger at at coaches. Did we get motion? There we go. Um, I know people want to point their finger at coaches, man, but. Think for yourself, man. Tony Pollard wasn't in the game a whole bunch, but we were. I, I was looking for this look the whole time to get Zeke and Tony on the field at the same time. Remember that? Um, remember that play that we that we uh, that we uh, talked about uh, talked about last week. The same kind of look. So this look is on film, and we could do a lot of things out of this look. The Tony in motion, um, Zeke stays look. We could do a lot of things with that, but um. Yeah, man, this 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 video ain't got to be forever, man. This ain't really a uh, one of the the videos in which I hit y'all with the with the nuanced details and things. That'll that'll probably be a video, um, the next video, the Dak Drive Killer video. That'll be more so uh, when we when we when we bring like details and nuance to the table. This is me pissed off because people saying that there were no pre snap motion. I mean, there's Jason Witten <laughs> uh, that that there was no pre snap motion. I don't know what game y'all was watching, but. It seems that you only watched the game one time. And you didn't. Uh, you didn't. You, you you just you just you just came up with whatever conclusion that you that you that you came up with. Um, if more people and I ain't even patting myself on the back like this, but what I like to do um, is you know like on my um, post game stream, the 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 one of the the the, the first things I say are like, hey man, don't come out and ask me no detail oriented questions. I will say nothing that's going to in 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 incriminate me in terms of uh <laughs> in terms of like a big bold take or anything like that because i haven't seen the game i haven't seen the the details multiple times well i've watched the film and i've seen details multiple times and i feel free standing on the table saying uh that there were pre-snap motion and that the saints gave us runs so we uh they, they gave us um run fronts for us to run into like so like I said, man, I ain't, I ain't gonna do this all day. I just wanted to kind of just show y'all uh, just a handful of this. If you want to see the rest plays, y'all can go watch film on your own. I'm not gonna um, hold y'all here, uh, you know, just or whatever, whatever. Can we run out this front? Was there any motion on this play? Let me go back and see. All right, so that's two plays that we didn't get pre-snap motion before we ran the football. I, I don't, 
I don't know, man. Anyway, um, the next video is Dak Prescott and Drive Killers. Y'all tune into that. And the third video is going to be something of the sort talking about our pass rushes. Z going into motion. Uh, something of the sort talk about our uh, pass rushes. Robert Quinn. And just a couple thoughts I got about D-Law. Um, so y'all definitely tune in. Uh, Ronald Cobb in motion. So y'all definitely tune into those uh, to those shows. And um, hey, man, cut somebody out that don't know what the hell they talking about. All right, y'all hold it down. Motion, y'all hold it down for the doski woski and the peaski whiskey man. Um, follow me on Twitter v o c h l o m b motion. Uh, v o c h l o m b a r d i. Um, shouts out to the sponsors. Shouts out to um the merch game. I'm going motion. I'm coming out with some t shirt designs. We're going to um to really get motion. We're gonna really get the uh get the merch back going and uh you know you know do that thing full fledged. We're also gonna do some some uh meet and greets too. I want to uh, uh do some do some do some Dallas stuff. Like to have a watch party maybe uh for one of these uh for one of these away games coming up just to find a little bar in Dallas, you know, find some Dallas natives and you know, watch the game man, you know, see what the move is motion. Uh or movement. <laughs> um you know just so we can watch the game man and see what the vibes are. All right. Um till next time man. Peace. My cable bill was way too high. I reached out to AffordableSticks.com. They sent me a fire stick, plugged that thing into the HDMI. Now I get unlimited shows, movies, and live TV. I'm a huge sports fan, so I love League Pass, Sunday Ticket, and I get the pay-per-view fights for free. That's something for the whole family. You can buy a fire stick for every TV in the house and still spend less money than you would on cable. That's AffordableSticks.com. There's a link in my description. You should go click it. Cut the cord, man. After canceling my cable, I saved $2,400 this year by switching to Beast TV through channelsforcheap.com. Some people pay $200 plus a month. I paid $120 a year. Or you can go $15 a month if that's what's convenient for you. You get 2,500 HD channels. A thousand of those are in English, and there are plenty of other international channels, TV Guide, and we get all the sports. One of my favorite things is multi-screen feature. So if I don't know what I want to watch, I can tune into four different channels at one time. That you can watch on four different devices, and it's available on Fire Sticks, Smart TVs, Tablets, and if you're on the go, you can watch TV on your phone. Hit the link in my description or go to channelsforcheap.com where you can get a free seven-day trial. That's a whole week for you to just sit down and play with it and see what you like about it. Then come back and make a purchase. If you have any questions, go to channelsforcheap.com. Hit this little button right here and they'll respond to you immediately. That is channels number four cheap.com. The link is in the description. I highly recommend it. Let's do it.